It's in the middle of the city on a Sunday afternoon, life's going on, apart from this little gathering here, we've got, what, 15, 20, 30 people talking quietly amongst themselves. There are support officers from the Selvos to help them if they wish. A guy just came up and put a Melbourne Victory soccer cap on the pile, I assume, in some sort of tribute uh, to, to the innocent man killed. There are a lot of messages written on the uh, on the wall of the building, a lot of flowers left, but it's not massive. This is actually where the incident began, where it all started. This is just a small gathering. Extraordinary thing though, that just strikes you as you walk up, the city's going on. People are just wandering around normally uh, until you get to this little pocket, the number of police there, the number of support workers, as I said. And people just standing around talking amongst themselves. I heard a guy saying it's just too too bad to believe and another one saying I can't even describe it. People are feeling about it and they're paying some sort of tribute but not in mass numbers, at least not here, not yet. Yeah, I, I don't know if it's um, <laughs> Tiredness or, or what's going on, but uh, I think oh, I, I think Friday, Neil, um, it, we saw probably the worst of Melbourne, um, and then very quickly we saw the best of Melbourne, where people putting their lives on the line to look out for strangers. And then I think um, we come up here yesterday, we we're here all day yesterday, and then today, this is just unbelievable. This is. Why? Oh, what do you mean? What, what's important about what's happening? Well, I think hey, this, this is strange just turning up. And you can see them, they're dropping flowers off, they're signing the condolence book, but they're doing more than that. They're actually, they're hugging, uh, they're checking on each other. Um, you know, we've had people coming up to us, checking in on us. Um, it, it, I, I think what this is, is this is actually Melbourne at its very best. And I think um, it's almost Melbourne garbage that we saw this This is the real Melbourne, we're not going to let anyone or anything wreck it.